Alright guys, um, I'm sorry about that video cut out because I ran out of space, but don't worry, I cleared up, I got rid of a whole bunch of old videos and pictures that I didn't need. Nothing important, so I can record fat more now, so let's go back in. Oh, shoot, shoot, crap, 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 I didn't realize. Okay, let's grab this stray fairy, just because we need it. Well, we don't need it, but it'll help us later on. Yeah, so we get the, we get the stray fairy, and these holes aren't actually dangerous. I know what you're thinking, they're, they look pretty, they look like they're gonna be an enormous problem, they really won't, just so, so we go through here, gotta fly to this platform, while trying to avoid all these dragonflies. Crap, oh, dodge. No, come on, come on, come on. Oh, dang it, we missed it. Tried just a little bit. Alright, so. I'm sorry, it's gonna take a long time to get over there, probably. I'm kind of a noob. Ha! Get your butt. Freaking Deku. Just get Deku in the butt. Around the tree, down through this, and you know what? Let's go ahead and oh shoot, let's not. I just, I just did the dumbest thing possible. You guys probably saw I caught myself. I did catch myself. I went to hit. I don't know why what I was thinking, but when I caught it, I hit A. It made me fall. Ow. Man, you're a jerk. You know what? Oh, wow. You actually. Holy crap. What the heck was that? I don't know. I just looked at the screen. It looked weird. It looked different for a second. Like, you could see the 3D in the game. No, don't fall down the hole. You know, let's bubble it. Let's bubble this piece of crap. Yeah. Get your face pounded. Oh gosh, come on. Come on, little... Come on, buddy. No. That was a close one. Alright, so let's pop it now. Because this thing's going to be making its way back over. So let's meet it halfway. Not exactly halfway, but... Alright, so yeah, meet it halfway. That's what we kind of did. And... <clears throat> just... I oh, made my arm. Just pop up to fly over. And go down these stairs. Pro you guys are probably thinking, why have I missed something? I'm not. I don't have dungeon item. I believe dungeon item. Not not this door. But I don't remember where the dungeon item is actually. <laughs> But, um, I believe, oh, no, it's this door up here. Let's hit this pressure plate as normal link. And, well, these two, these two ladders will appear. So, we can break these just for, oh, I didn't mean to roll into it, but, you know, they broke, so they broke. I believe this door, yes, this is, this door, I believe, is a boss, is a mini boss. Yep, I believe, thi yes, this guy's holding the, oh, 
Oh, I think we need to be a Deku Link to kill this thing. Hit him with a bubble. Oh, no, because we're made of wood. We can't get hit by fire. Dang it. Now I got some soft in my under my elbow. Just keep thwacking him. Why do you freeze it? Dang it. No, okay, we can't be Deku Link to kill this. We gotta figure out a way to get him. Please tell me we don't need the dungeon item. No, okay, now I remember. Just when he fire breeze, block, and uh, until then, relentlessly hit him. Like that. Oh dang it, man! Try, try on the air. That's the name of this video. All right, yeah. So this chest is the dungeon item, I believe. I'm really hoping it is, and I'm pretty sure it's the bow. Yes. Like I knew the dungeon item was. I just could not remember if it was the dungeon item or not. All right. So let's leave the door. Or is there anything we have to shoot? Let's equip the bow to X, and actually let's put the Deku Stick to Y, because we don't really need the fairy in a bottle to be showing up. Alright, so, what we do first with this is fire at this eye, and this, this flower platform will just keep moving up and down, up and down, up and there. You get, you get the idea. So what we do is fall down here. That's not what I wanted to do. Dang it, I should have just taken the ladders. Oh, wait, the ladders aren't. Well, never mind. But, uh, yeah, become Deku Link. Wait for it to hit the ground. Oh, don't wait for it to hit the ground. Okay, wait for it to get close to hitting the ground. Dang it, don't. Okay, just. You know, don't do what I do. Just do what I'm saying I'm gonna do. Alright, here. There we go. No. I hate this game. Oh my gosh, come on. Okay, Deku Link. No, don't get trapped under. Thank you. Alright, so, finally. Now, take the platform, ride it up. Fly over here. And open this door for the final dungeon boss. Actually, no, fight him as a Deku scrub. I forgot. Okay, he's going to spawn a quack quack turtle. What you do is wait for him to go over your flower, pop up, and he'll just Z target him. You become Deku Link at the I mean, normal Link at this point and shoot him with the bow. That's your best way to hit him. Deku Link again. Get in the flower. Let the turtle come over you again. You'll probably waste a few arrows on this. Now, I believe... Okay, okay night of the first day. We're, we're going to beat this by the time I said we would, no doubt. Because this boss just leads you practically straight to where you need to go. What are you 
said you didn't read. Alright, so walk. Sorry. Hope you guys didn't hear that. If you did, sorry about that. It was just a little uh, conversation. Hey, no. Get away, buddy. Sorry, my cat's trying to knock this over. And we got the boss key. Take him out. Take him out. I'm just saying, can you take him out, please? <clears throat> so, you get the boss key. Now, what we do is. I think. Actually, I think there's a stray fairy in this room. No? Okay. Alright, so we leave the room. Alright, so, um, sorry, it happened again. Alright. So, jump in the flower. Why is the platform not moving anymore? Crud. So get in here. I think there's a stray fairy in this. Yep, stray fairy. This is ninth crap. I think there's three more. Oh, but I, they're all in the same room, I think. So we're good. We're good now. All right. So what we do now is fire a flaming arrow into the torch in the middle of this platform, and you'll see the water change. And these flowers shrivel up. So they won't. They aren't. Car they aren't carnivorous anymore. Good. Lucky for us. All right. So go over to this platform. Become Deku Link and fly to this spot over here. Land on. Become Deku Link. I mean, normal Link. Push this down. And another stray fairy chest will appear. Okay, I no, I, I guess this. I think it's a stray fairy chest. I'm hoping it is because I'm real. I don't. I really don't want it to be anything else, honestly. So if it if it's not, I'm just. Eh, I'll just deal with it. I'm hoping it's stray fairy though, because I want. I just. I've actually never seen what this this great fairy does. Ah, oh, why do I keep doing that? Oh, no, we made, we made a bad choice. Okay, so we can actually swim in the water now. So let's swim over here. Climb back up this. Wow. Oh, we're, actually, we've only been 30 minutes? Dang. We're making good time. Now we need to line this bow up with the fire. Oh, whoops. Actually, no, line this bow up with the torch and kabam! Dang it, ah, oh, we missed just a bit. There we go, we got it. Oh, sorry, you guys didn't see that because of the flat shine. Nope, let me turn that off. See, it doesn't get in the way. Alright, but we lit that torch, and so, no, it's this door that opened up. The final room, other than the boss. Oh, we, didn't, we almost didn't make that. Um, alright, see, there's a fairy right there, you'll see it. But, so this room is extremely complicated. I want actually okay. I wouldn't say extremely complicated, just very difficult. So grab this fairy. Let's break these to get some extra things, and jump up here for another fairy. I believe there's more. There's another fairy or two over here, but there might not be. This next fairy might be our last fairy. Oh nope. Okay, there's two more fairies. The one we've already seen, and you might you see it right there now. So grab this fairy. First, what we need to do is. 
Okay, uh, this is gonna be tricky. It's gonna be, we're gonna have to be quick. Be normal link, shoot that. Become Deku link quick. Fly up onto this and see if we can, yes, we, ju we made the jump. Get this stray fairy. Nope, stray fairy, come back here. There. Ow. I hate the soundtrack for this because the screams are, I, hate, I hate them so much. Like when you turn into Deku Link, the scream it makes a lot of times is annoying. Uh, when Deku Link gets hurt, I hate that noise. God, we're still gonna beat this by the time I said, don't worry guys. There's not a lot more to do. So fly up here. Do do what we did earlier. I would do it to the left now though. Yeah, and we just hit our head on a block. So I guess we didn't need to beat Normal Link at that one moment. Okay, so fly up. Oh, crud, 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 crud. Catch, catch it, catch it. Yeah. Alright, jump up. Land. G dive. Jump up. Let's ignore these two red rupees, but you guys can stop for them if you ever want to. I'm not gonna, because I want to beat this, like, right now. Alright, these are just like special things all right so we are we have entered the boss room all right so you walk forward and the boss starts playing this instrument he jumps down this is Ottawalla, the jungle the masked jungle warrior oh Adolwa. sorry I, keep say I always say his name wrong so dive, and he loses track of you. So simply do that, and persistently hit his eye. He'll jump away again. Just keep doing this. He'll he'll lose track of you every time. Now dive down one more time. I know there's some extra damage we can get right now. And slap that booty. That thing's just for speaking something. I can't understand what he's saying though. I know he'll spawn these annoying little bugs which can easily be killed just by doing that. So, kabam! Hit his eye, like we always do. The last bug, kill it. This time, he's, he has, he knows where you, you're going. Alright, so we've got, we've killed, once you've kill, killed him, just, um, we would have killed them the last time if that bug didn't keep hitting us. So make sure you walk into that, and then, so walk into that to pick up the mat, pick up the heart container, sorry, can't think of it, and walk into this little vortex looking thing, and we'll pick up Odolwa's remains. So, and so you'll be spawned up on top of this pillar. And just like every Zelda game, you collect something, then you learn there's more. I guess every other Zelda game, some other Zelda games, 
you instantly learn this more than one. But something will pop up. This guy is called a guardian. You can't see him very well. You can just there, there he is. It's kind of, it's kind of ugly. It's just this big face with long legs, long arms, and a mustache. And he's trying to teach us a song. It's Y R L R I A. Actually, I actually didn't really know that, so I, I kind of understood it after a while. So Y L R L Y A. It's called the Oath to Order. It doesn't really become important. It's not really important right now. Not until later in the game. We learn the elf order. So now the guardian will begin t talking to us. It talks really slow. I hate it. Call us. Sounds like some kind of pickup line. No, wait, no, no, no. They aren't talking slow. They talk normal. Just that Tattle knows their language. And just can't understand it as well as, of course, they do. And it speaks really slow when she says it. Alright, so all the water in the swamp is no lo none of it's poisoned anymore. And this path will appear to a secret little area. And we're in the secret little area. This area we could never have been, gotten to before. Now, so she's talking about how her brother Tail was telling us about um, the other three. Now she's talking about what she did to your horse and all the stuff she done before. She says she's sorry. She apologizes. Then we so we go in order of that list we were told, and we'll see these vines that. I want. I need to see something. These flowers do anything? No, they just sit here, dead. Simple as that. Okay. So, um, you remember later on, earlier on the Deku King's talking about his princess, his daughter being missing. This is her. All right. So. We bow in front of her, and so she'll ask if the monkey sent us. She'll say yes. We'll say yes, of course. And her, she says she knew her father would be angry. She starts crying. She's free now. She does, she didn't actually think her father would do anything horrible to the monkey. Quickly, Mr. YouTube. All right, so we're gonna have to get rid of our fairy. Bye, bunny. Bye, bud. So um, and what we do here is a little weird. Yeah. We just put the princess in a bottle.
Yeah. I know it's really weird. We just put the princess in a bottle. Alright, so walk through this doorway. I think we can just play... No, we don't have to play anything. I thought we might just need... Yeah, so we can just fall in the water and we can swim now, because water's clean. Remember what I said? We beat the dungeon on four first day? 11.21 on the... F at PM on the first day. So, we beat it before the first before the first day was over. It's a good accomp- I think it's good, a good accomplishment. So become a Deku again. Cause these guys will not let you go through unless you're a Deku. Yeah. <sighs> so, go through this doorway. Walk in, and you'll see the monkey still tied there. And the princess will start nagging on you. And approach, approach the king. And open the bottle, and the princess will appear. Kapow! <laughs> and she'll start bouncing on her, on the Deku King's belly. Oh wait, no, she'll be- she's beating him up. Cause she's da- she's mad at her father for the- be hurting the monkey. And we get a pretty useless item for winning. I mean, for bringing her back. It's in the shrine next to the palace, and the butler will be waiting there. We'll go through the shrine later. Uh, so, but, uh, right now, I'm gonna end the video. <clears throat> so, um, thank you, for, thank you guys for watching. Um, hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe for our first dungeon accomplishment together. Yeah, I'm gonna save right here so I don't lose anything. Lose any data. And, uh, see you guys in the next 